What's up, Internet? It's Mal. Today I'm showing you how to take your Elgato Wave microphone and getting it to work with your Team Speaker Discord through the Wavelink software. And I'm sure we all did the same thing when we first got this. We went in here, we set our Discord to uh, voice or whichever channel you wanted to use, and what's up? It's, it's not working. Um, what you got to do for Discord, get into voice and video, set input device to mic in, and output device, set it to the chat or whichever channel you want. And now it's gonna automatically show in the voice chat channel, the way I have it set, and it's gonna say default here, and it's fine, it's working, I've tested it. It's excellent, and it's virtually the same thing in TeamSpeak, hit tools, options, playback, uh, I leave this on automatic best. I haven't adjusted anything in here except playback device. I set that to voice chat. Now, the Elgato Wavelink software is amazing. I love it, but it's still on an early, you know, early version. I still get issues where sometimes whatever I have set to aux one, for example, the next time I start my computer, it's not showing up. And then it says, yo, this program is set to aux one. It should be fine. I'm, I, I fix that right now just by changing it to something and then changing it back and then it works. Um, fortunately, uh, the Discord and the TeamSpeak is working fine. And one of my browsers is also always going to the right channel without any issues. But some programs I'm having issues and I just solve that by, like I said, switch it to something and switch it back. I'd be doing a sound check before every stream just because software is on early version. And... That's it. I stream on this channel just about every day, so subscribe for that. Hope this helped. Peace.